time I got to do a post this fight bout interview. Will be three three him. minute rounds and it's for the vacant epic middleweight championship. <laughs> Set to make his way to the cage out of the blue corner, Dean Sherry. Now, now and his he opponent can submit making you. his entrance to the cage out of the red corner, Xavier. Silva! And Xavier Silva, 2-0, and age 22, weighed in at 184.8 pounds, six foot one, fighting out of Silva Jiu-Jitsu. And you, and you actually interviewed Silva after his last fight, correct? Yes, sir. And I mean, this is this is a big amateur. That's a big guy. Yeah, you can see the size difference in the two of them. But here's the difference: wrestler versus jujitsu. But the thing about Silva, right? TKO to his name, very powerful early. Very south, powerful guy. Southpaw. Yes. Southpaw. Right. And then he starts quick. And, you know, if you think about it, you can walk forward a little bit more aggressively because you have that black belt, right? You can throw and commit to your strikes. Yeah, when, when you're not worried about getting taken down. Take me down. Right. I, I wish you would. Yeah, I wish you would. That was my down. whole thing. Right. I was a good striker. I had striking from the yard, training with Mark Kimura and, and, and Joe, Joe Schilling. Right. But... The 10th plan of jiu-jitsu made me fearless in the cage. You take me down, I'm going to submit you. Yeah, 100%. So either you're going to stand and bang with me, or you can go ahead and take your chances of going down. Right. And Dean's tough. I've seen Dean do work on very good pros. So, I mean, I'm really looking forward to this fight. San Diego, California. Well, when you get up to this level. Once again, this, this battle like will be fights. three, three minute rounds, and it's for the vacant epic middleweight championship. Introducing first, out of the Stars Therapy Blue Corner, holding a record of one win, one defeat, standing five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 183.2 pounds, representing the training center from San Diego, California. Ladies and gentlemen, Dean Sherry. And his opponent across the cage out of the Royal Collision Center red corner. Holding an undefeated record with two wins. Standing six feet one inches tall. Weighing in at 184.8 pounds. Representing Silva Jiu-Jitsu. He hails from El Cajon. Please welcome Xavier. Silva! Your referee in charge of the action, Steve Quick. All right, fellas, we know the rules of the locker room. You got questions, ask now. Touch gloves if you want, come out. And just like that, we're underway. Big oh, fight. nice Outside kick by Sherry. Kick. Oh, you Silva. You see the power out of Silva. Oh, my goodness. Silva with the big slam. Oh, Full wow. mount. Wow. I guess he told Sherry, I don't care if you're a D1 wrestler, but I'm a black belt. Big I have my body. own jujitsu studio, and your arm is coming home with me right now. Triangle, oh, triangle set up, beautiful, Smooth. beautiful Re set up. Oh, this is high level jujitsu. Dang, 
And he still has the arm. Stretch it out, stretch it out. The referee is real close. He wants to watch it. Oh, and that thing is getting just tighter and tighter and tighter. Arm bar. Arm bar is deep. He's transitioned all the way to the full arm bar. The ref is letting Nice it flip go. over. I can't even walk. Right back to the triangle. This dude is transitioning his tail off right now. Man. But Sherry survived. And now he he's survived. on the top. I thought it was over. Can opener. <laughs> old school ground and pound by Sherry. Of and course he's, he's going to be old school. You see his mustache. Chris Lieben. Ooh, and he's already setting up the triangle from the bottom again. Sherry's got to keep that right arm in. Sherry's right where he wants to be. He has Silva's head against that cage. It's going to be really hard to use your jujitsu when you're stuck against that cage like that. You don't get the leverage. Passes. See, Sherry's right now has just been an old school, heavy, dirty Chris Tito Lieben. Ortiz. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Hey, Watch I'll out. be in your guard. I don't care. Heavy punches. I got this Ooh. nice cop mustache going. Sherry just transitioning. You got to oh, oh back to the arm bar triangle. Silva is really 45 seconds left. He's relying on that jujitsu. Stacking heavy on Sherry. Nice transition. Sherry's out again. Man. The defense out of Sherry. Twenty seconds left. Xavier threatening submission multiple times, but Sherry just scoring. And Xavier was a little too intense when he came out. Too intent on trying to get this submission instead of settling so him close. down. Let's see how he can recover and come back in this next round, because he was in a dominant position. But once Sherry got out and got on top, he was relentless. Yeah, but he, a little bit of work right now. And, and Xavier. He came just, out just firing. Out firing, a little blitz, shoots in on the double, finishes it. Beautiful power takedown right here. <laughs> And had had Dean in trouble a couple times. In deep trouble. Right? And, and Dean Dean stayed composed. And I, honestly, I thought he won that round. I, I feel like the the ground and pound outweighs the submission attempt. Yes. It always does. Because he's causing damage. You're going for attempts. You're going to end the fight. It's like throwing the Hail Mary. Right. But you didn't catch it. Yeah. So it doesn't count. Right. It, it's... More or less the equivalent of throwing a big overhand that just missed. Yeah, but it missed. He's not getting off the stool. I don't understand what's going on right now. I think they're bringing in the doctor. They're bringing somebody to check him out. Something happened. Scenario, ladies and gentlemen, I'm trying to figure out. They, the Silva doctor. better suck it up, or he's going to lose this title shot. And it's and waved off. Waved it off. <laughs> Dean Sherry, bro, man. I guess some of those ground and pound shots really got to got to Xavier Silva. He came out looking impressive, but just couldn't pull the trigger in the right spots. Man. Dean Cherry, your new middleweight champion. And let's see if we can try to figure out what exactly happened right there. I mean, Dean was definitely throwing some big ground and pound. 
big mat return right there. I'm looking at Xavier's left knee right now. It definitely looks a little shaky. A little shaky. bit of feedback from the camo right now. Xavier definitely looking very shaky on his legs. And Dean is as pumped up as can be. What what did camo say to you? Well from what I heard from the uh inspector was Xavier complained about getting hit in the back of the head. So he felt he was unable to continue from a dirty shot. But I wouldn't have called that. You know, it's really hard when you're not obviously targeting the back of the head, right? Yes. You know, we're rolling in transitions. When I threw the punch, when I threw the punch, your ear was exposed. About the last second you turn your head. You know, I, I understand understand getting hit in the back of the head, but that's kind of like, unfortunately, well, you can kind of get away with it a little bit. That's one of those things, the fighter's not supposed to make that call. Right. The referee will make that call for you. You're gonna have to live with the decision. Ah, he kind of hit me with a bad shot. Right. I didn't like it, so I'm gonna stop the fight now. Yeah, I mean, hey, compliments to Dean though. I hey. thought that fight was over. Arm extended. Arm extended, fought off the triangle multiple times. Was just like, nah, bro, I wrestle. Well, Ain't nothing to me. Once Dean got to his spots, it was his damage. And Xavier didn't throw ground and pound. Dean threw ground and pound. That's the real pound. difference. Big ground and pound. Did one maybe clip the back of his head? Maybe. Maybe. Was it to San the point Diego, to where he couldn't California. continue? I don't think so. After the first round, we are ending this bout due to Dr. Stoppage, which means your new epic middleweight champion, Dean Sherry. And you can, you can just see, thump, thump, thump. I mean, it's those small bat, those small gloves crack. 